Welcome to the view. So we almost did not have this guest on because because he, Michael forgot to tell the special uh, guest no, star because, that he was the special guest star. No, it was because the number that I have for him programmed in my phone was his is his girlfriend's uh, number, and um, we didn't get it. The message. Well, before we invite Steve out, I, I have to tell you that we had the most ridiculous conversation uh, earlier this week because we were talking about Michael's mom, Elkie, who oh. was mad at you oh, yeah. because she was watching CNN yeah, and, oh, seeing, oh. and all the, you know, the escape killers from the Clinton Correctional Facility. So guess what she, she said, said to Michael? She said, I thought you said it was impossible to break out of that place. <laughs> and, and I said... <laughs> I said, Mom, the place has been open, it's been around for a hundred years and nobody has broken out. You can't do anything right. Yeah, she said, she said, how do you think it makes me feel? She said, I, she said, you didn't even try. Everybody knows that you went there and these other two guys break out and you didn't, you didn't break out, you didn't even try. But she, but she was serious. She was, this was like, yeah, th this was not a joke. This is not a joke. This is, she was like very serious about it. You and can't she, do anything she, right. And she brought it up twice. This, she You're up twice. worthless son. Yeah. Can you can't even break out of prison, right? So now you know why he's the now way you he know is. why I'm the way I am. <laughs> <laughs> so our next guest is a nightclub legend. Yeah, another another one. Another one. Yeah. <laughs> Please welcome Steve Lewis. <laughs> <laughs> so many of you may have been turned away from some of his clubs. In fact, I think all of them, I think. In fact, Steve might have personally turned you away. Uh, these are invites from Michael's uh, art show. They're gorgeous. Yes, uh, I used to run my clubs. So you, and may, now have been, you may have been turned away, uh, away from spa. You may have been uh, turned away from life. Plaid. World, tunnel, limelight, yeah. USA, red zone. Uh, he was out there. A lot of them. Um, that was a long time ago in a galaxy far, far away. I remember you turned away Bjork once because we didn't recognize her because she looks so different. Without I just didn't makeup. like her. No, but I, remember, <laughs> I but mean, you weren't even sure if it was her, though. Yeah, but I don't care. I, 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 I like Cher impersonators in all the time, even though I didn't believe they would tell me the Cher. And I, it was just so fabulous. And if someone wants to try, but Bjork, I found to be a miserable bitch, and I just didn't like. I know Richie, Richie liked her. Richie, Richie, uh, Richie, Richie Rich. Rich. Yeah, he he would bring her around, but. I, I never got along. Well, I'm convinced that nobody really likes Bjork's music because, I mean, when you when you listen to it, I mean, it's I mean, it's like this orchestral it's screeching. It's kind of difficult. I, I to just can't. To I can't take it. I can't believe anybody likes it. I like it. I don't like her, but I like her music. Oh, okay. Well, I, mean, I like I like her looks and her outfits, but I don't like. Her she's music. one of us, so we shouldn't complain. She's very yeah. pro everything we're pro. So you know, you know I, she's well, on like our, I said, she's I on like our her. team. She's I, just, I, I just don't want She's on our team, but you don't like her. I don't like her. You're on my team, and I don't like you much. So. Wow. And I feel the same about you. Thank you. <laughs> I know Michael since he was a little kid, which he still Last is. Last week, yeah. Yeah, I mean, no, but when he, when he first started, and he was a bus boy at, what was it, Dance mm -hmm. and, and, uh, remember you And I was in a meeting with Rudolph, who was the most fabulous person any of us ever met, and I was pitching this party, and he said, oh, I have this boy who wants to come in and tell us some party and Michael came in and just took over my meeting and blew me away and I, as he walked out I looked at him and said wow that kid's gonna be something and of course since oh he was something yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so, I, so I, I had to exploit that and I became friends with him because yeah. of it because I knew he, I needed him yeah so and he still needs me. <laughs> I don't know about that, that Michael. I, I'm, I'm kind of. Uh, I, I, I of, think we all got we got along. I, got very a, well I did well. well I don't know I had to come home and set everybody straight. Yeah, that's true. You have mm -hmm. you have made an impact in the brief time you have been with us again. And uh, although I think myself and other people were with you while you were there, we visited you. But now that you're back amongst us, you are making mo making moves. This is one of the moves you're making. And I think it's amazing that this, your spirit, that no matter, that I went to the places he went, was staying in, and they weren't very pleasant, even for a tough guy like me. But he, he, he came out of it, and he's pretty much the Michael I remember. I don't see any visible signs of... Uh, <laughs> I which is which is really really scary, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> On that note, we'll, we'll be right back. Okay. And now a word from our sponsor.
<laughs> Welcome back to the view. <laughs> so, Steve has been traveling around the world, oh, consulting God. with clubs. I know you were in Thailand. Mostly uh, Thailand. What are your current projects? Tell us I'm, what's, I'm, what's new. What's fresh? I, I completed a good room in. Uh, Brooklyn, uh, which in Greenpoint, which was, uh, it's a house music club, and it won Best Nightclub uh, from New York Magazine a few months ago. And now I'm working on uh, Valentine. I'm taking Red Star, which is a 24-hour sports bar in, uh, in Greenpoint. I'm making it into a, I'm sorry, it was a sports bar in Greenpoint. I'm making it into a 24-hour restaurant with a club attached. What happened to the roof at Space? Weren't you doing something on the roof? I was doing the roof at Space, but they don't have any money. They're not doing Because well. I went to the roof at Space the other day looking no, for I went what to design. No, no, no. And no, no. there were like a couple potted plants. Yeah, 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 and, like yeah, a, yeah. and I said, did Steve do this? No, if there's a potted, if, <laughs> if there's a potted plant, <laughs> I didn't do it. Right. <laughs> Right. I actually took somebody there bragging about how I, I knew the designer of this. They didn't have the money. It's simple. The, the large clubs, Pasha, Space, all the large clubs. But how clubs, do all these clubs in Greenpoint have the money to hire because you? It's, because you Because everybody here should be living in Greenpoint. <laughs> I mean, the bottom line, I'm not cheap, but I, I am working out there uh, pro bono. I mean, I'm doing, uh, doing it because I love it, and I want what I'm doing. I want my art, which is design, to exist, and I want to do something in Brooklyn uh, because that's where I live now, and I love it, and I want to show them something. So. Let it run with that. Well, be before I forget, we also wanted to talk. I don't know if you guys were watching CNN last week when Michael had that crazy moment. Oh on God, screen. yeah. So um, <laughs> that was wonderful, by the way. Can you uh, <laughs> can you please explain? Yes. Well, what happened was I was sitting on the stage like I am now, and I was uh, tweeting that I was about to go on. What was it? Uh, I'm about to go on it national was, uh, news, everybody. It was, it was the Kelly, the Kelly da -dee -da -dee -da. Files. It was the Kelly Files, and so I was just about to push tweet, and they said you're on, and so I threw the phone to to David and um, his husband, and um, David missed the phone, and I went like that because I saw my phone crash ah. to the ground, and they, you know, that was that. And the then problem. Gawker made that Gawker fabulous made the gift. gift. Going over and over and over and over. <laughs> the rest is history. Yeah. Oh. Bitches want to know. What do they want to know? Well, the, you know, Screaming Rachel's in the audience, and one time I was on TV, <laughs> and I was on CNN, and, uh, and I was supposed to be on, and I, was, I did this whole segment, and I was very proud of it, because here I was. But at the same week, I was on Channel 35, I guess it was the all-access porn channel, and Screaming yeah, Rachel was running the... You were running... <laughs> 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 oh, no. and, and, and she was... And she was, she interviewed me. So that week, everyone oh. said, I saw you on TV, and I say, CNN? And they go, no, on Channel 35, which oh, means Rachel. <laughs> Nobody saw me on CNN. Yeah, um, the porn channel was the most popular. We know that. Yeah, among my crowd, I guess, yes. Okay. <laughs> No. So, I guess bitches want to know about the porn channel. <laughs> well, this bit, uh, Bobby Sewell wants to know oh. if you have ever thought about reviving the scene oh. that you created from all that you've learned and experienced since it all went down. This is a question for How me. How can you make Steve. it so much better now? It's a perfect question for Steve yeah. and for you. I, I, you know, we, you we, don't like to relive the past. I do, I do have a past. I have a, I have a, I have a Facebook page called New York City Close Club. Game you can all join. Is and that what the we, dinosaur thing? Yeah, no, no. This dinosaur is another thing. That's our friend. Him, but he may not let and you we win. throw parties. <laughs> we we throw parties every two months. We just did Nels and we recreated Nels really? with all the old DJs. And for one night, it was there. I mean, it was it was at the space. Uh, we're doing another uh, one in August 10th, I think it was around there. And we'll do it. You can't recreate the past. It's it's too many different factors. S the clubs cannot be created. We can't live in the past either. I I don't. When they call me a club legend, I check my pulse. But I also <laughs> Like to, I like to be defined in what I'm doing now, which is, of course, a product of my history and what I've learned, as this person pointed out. But I don't think I could, we could do what we did because yeah. the, the crowd isn't there. However, with that being said, Brooklyn is really hot, and there's lots of things going on underground. I mean, people ask me if there are any after-hours clubs. There's lots of after-hours clubs. There's lots of stuff going on. You just got to look in the cracks, and if, we, and if you're looking in the cracks, that means that the crackheads aren't getting in, you know, and the crackers are not getting in. So that's kind of cool. So I live in the underground in Brooklyn, and I'm 62 years old, and I've, you know, of course, you're only as young as the woman you feel, and my girl... <laughs> so, she's young. And yeah, she's young. I see. Embarrassingly yeah. so. Yes, young. I'm young at heart. Where is the heart? I, I don't know where my heart is. I know it's small. Too bad you're not young at heart. <laughs> not used a lot. And in case, no, in case Viagra, in, in case you're wondering about the after hours tonight, uh, Lady Fag is doing her shade party tonight. It goes exactly. till 9 a.m. I believe. That's right. In an undisclosed secret location. Oh in please, Brooklyn. just dial the number. Yeah. <laughs> Google it. It's on. 
All right, well, anyway, that's it. So I think the scene can't be recreated, but there's a lot. We don't have to recreate it. There's a lot going on right now. And Michael's back with us, and that's great. And that's the today's See you next time. Bye. Bye. Bye.